What's up guys, this is Bhushan, welcome to Bbytes video tutorial and in this tutorial I am going to teach you the directory commands of Unix and how to execute those commands. The very first command I am going to show you is the pwd command. The pwd means print working directory and this command is used to display the current working directory. That is, this command displays the directory name that we are using, that we are working right now. If you want to execute this command just go on type pwd and hit enter it shows the result that is we are working in a client directory and the client directory is inside the home directory and whatever we create a directory and whatever we create a files that will be in client directory once again guys pwd means print working directory and this command is used to display the current working directory the next command I'm gonna show you is the ls command and this ls command is used to display the list of files and directories in the current working directory if you want to execute this command just go on type ls and hit enter it displays the all your files and directories in a current working directory here is the name of the directories and files in client directory I am working in a client directory here I am files called Bhushan Ravi Ubuntu like this once again guys ls command is used to display the files and directories in a current working directory just go on type ls and hit enter it displays all your files and directory names in a current working directory the next command I'm gonna show you is mkdir command and this means make directory this command is used to create a directory if you want to create a directory just go on type mkdir and give a space and give a directory name type whatever you type whatever you wish to give a name like I want to give b bytes and hit enter if you didn't get any errors then the directory is created if you want to see whether the directory is created or not just go on type ls and hit enter it shows all your files and directory names in the screen as I told earlier see b bytes before executing before creating a directory here we don't have a directory called b bytes but once I created a directory now we have a directory called b bytes so the directory is created here once again guys make directory is used to create a empty directory in your disk if you want to create a directory just go on type mkdir and give a space and give your di directory name and hit enter the directory is created if you want to check the check whether the directory is created or not just go on type ls command it shows all your directories names and file names on the screen the next command I'm gonna show you is the cd command the cd command is used to move from one directory to another directory for example now I'm in a client directory now I want to move to b bytes directory so you need to use cd command just go on type cd and give a space give a directory name where we wish to move I want to go inside the b bytes directory then just type b bytes and hit enter 
now you are in b bytes directory just see and whatever you now whatever you create or whatever you do that will be in b bytes directory and now i want to come out from b bytes directory just go on type cd and give a front slash and hit enter and once again hit enter will come out of b bytes directory once again guys cd command is used to move from one directory to another directory just go on type cd and give a space and give a directory name that you wish to move and hit enter you will be in that directory and if you come out from that directory just go on type cd front slash and enter and enter you will be come out of that directory the next command i'm going to show you is rmi rmdir command that means remove directory uh, this command is used to delete the directory from your disk just remember one thing guys if you want to delete a directory then the directory must be empty just go on type just go on type rm dir and give a space and the directory name that you wish to delete i wish to delete b bytes directory just type b bytes and hit enter if you didn't get any errors then the directory is removed if you want to check whether the directory is delete or not just go on type ls and hit enter it will shows the all your directories and files names just look at the result guys here we don't have a directory called b bytes so the directory is deleted once again guys rm dir command is used to delete the directory from your disk remember one thing guys if you want to remove a directory then the directory must be empty if you have uh, any files or directories in the directory first you need to delete those files and directories later you have to remove the directory that you wish to delete otherwise you can't delete the directory so thanks for watching don't forget to subscribe i'll see you in next tutorial guys